Hey everybody. So as you know, my name is Keontae Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for our Divine Feminines. All right, so all of our DF, Empress, High Priestess, Energy only. If you in any way at all identify as Divine Masculine Hunty, you can go ahead and get that because this reading right now is not for you, all right? Let us go ahead, you all. Let us jump right into the message. Let us see what the reading has for you, okay? What are the messages here on today? Thank you, thank you, thank you, spirit. Thank you. What are the messages for feminine? What does she need to know, spirit? What does she need to know? Love. Love conquers all, feminine. Intense. Whew. Yeah, I feel that. The intensity of a true soul connection includes great highs and great lows. Attraction. No matter what, this person is drawn to you. When they experience great things in their life, they want to share those things with you. When they're having really, really rough, tough moments, they want to be near you, be comforted by you. Okay? Let love show you how to learn from each other. You're learning a lot. Okay? Even throughout... Or while learning each other's differences. You complete the picture for one another in some sort of way here. As cheesy as it may sound, guys. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. Okay, recognition. You recognize this. And so union can happen. Union can come into fruition. All right, wherever there were any energy leaks, you're plugging that up. Okay, wherever there was any, you know, anything or anyone leeching onto you or your person's energy, you're cutting that cord. The divine will help you recognize signs and miracles. You're getting signs everywhere. They're all around you. All right. The union of divine soul counterparts is a miraculous event that begins when you least expect it. So a lot of you have possibly given up and have gotten to that place where you're like, you know what, I'm good, I'm, I'm over it. And right when you do that is when it's gonna come in. Yeah, labyrinth, because you know, you're like, oh, I have to find my way through this maze. This maze being my way back to them, my way back to their heart, our way back to each other. Whatever it was, you had to learn through something major or multiple things. Multiple occurrences have taken place. Okay, but all of that was so that you could learn what love really is about. Okay, what it's all about. So let us see. Mm. Okay. Messages for feminine. Sacred convergence. Okay. Brand new beginning. Yep. Wow. Cosmic butterfly. Be patient, feminine. Continue to love. Your person will see. Within nothing, there is everything. Some of you may feel like there's nothing I can do, there's nothing I can say, and you're right. Yin yang lover, you don't have to. Spirit says everything that needs to be said will be said for you. Everything that this person needs to see, they will see you on their own. If there isn't anything that you need to say or do. They will see it. They will get it. Why did they take me to this one? I'm just going to be obedient. <laughs> Someone's going through a spiritual awakening, material world. Okay, had them in a chokehold for a minute. But they're realizing, okay, there's more to life. 
there's so much more to life within nothing there's everything someone could have been wondering i wonder why feminine lives like that why does she do this why does she do that why does he do this why does he do that why do they do that why are they like that and now as they're going through their spiritual awakening yeah their vibration is changing and shifting and they're like whoa you know it's a whole new world they're seeing everything different okay jasmine voice all right they're seeing everything different now okay let's see what are the messages here okay lessons <laughs> alone they're never truly alone because the one that loves them is always right there this person can you know maybe possibly they feel alone at times yeah a karmic partner this person likes to have control over them oh child all right but they surrender they surrender to what is okay it's no good that control thing yeah free will you know we all have free will choice all right the reason blue is like wow to this cosmic butterfly i'm going to post it on a story just because you know <laughs> proof is everything right the proof is in the pudding why i was outside cleaning my porch earlier i mean it is easter sunday i'm outside cleaning my porch earlier and i see a caterpillar not just any caterpillar the caterpillar has purple and like yellow and all that stuff on it and is this not purple and yellow and i recorded it and i'm speaking to the caterpillar and i say you have no idea what your life is about to become <laughs> i'm gonna post the video but that's just blue being blue you know you really have no idea what your life is about to become little caterpillar yeah look wow go to your auntie's house go to your auntie's house six minutes 56 seconds on the timestamp. six is the number of routine it's the number of partnerships it's the number of relationships okay and 56 is 11. so i really do feel like union is coming in we have it here twice yeah, I feel like you can see something clearly now or your person can now see through the labyrinth, see their way around something, through something, something. All right, there's reconciliation, eternal love. Your time has come. I said to that caterpillar, you have no idea. <laughs> okay, so to pass that message along from me to you, you have no idea what your life is about to become. No idea. So you could have been in solitude for a minute. Maybe a person has been in solitude. They've been in their man cave, woman cave, you know, whatever um, you identify as or they identify as. You've been in your, you know, your hermit energy. But on the horizon is this fresh start. Okay. New opportunity, a chance to release the past and start anew. Okay. This is your second chance. Begin again. Okay. Mm, somebody feel like they can finally breathe again you're a breath of fresh air therefore when you're not around they feel like they cannot breathe oh look another butterfly and then i just heard um that song by mario in my head that's what i'm channeling earlier i was channeling aaron hall i believe that's his name i miss you I, that's the name of the song i think right i'm talking to you baby i miss you that's the name of that right Mm-hmm. Yeah. So breakthrough, reinvention. You're ready for the next level. Okay. Control. Yeah. Mm, somebody could have been trying to control or fight their feelings for a really long time. They're wearing this mask. It ain't working. It's not working. Because they sit there, they write, they contemplate. And with doing that, they have learned, they have discovered that they are in love. Or this is you. All right. I feel like it's the both of you, to be honest with you. I'm just going to keep it all the way 100. Yeah, we got an offer. So now there's an offer coming through. Somebody has healed their inner child. Yeah, masculine. See, they have healed their inner child. You know, they have um, altered their beliefs. And it's not because you said, hey, yeah, hey, change the way you're thinking about life and love. No. But through the way that you love them and the way that you just show up as you. Like, first of all, this person comes bearing gifts. And they're not carrying a whole bunch of materialistic items in their bag, which is usually what that devil energy, karmic energy represents, materialism. This is God's gifts. This is nature. She has flowers in her bag. I come to you bearing flowers. And here's the thing about it, right? It might sound weird to give your man flowers, but does it? Considering everything that they say flowers represent, does it? 
You know, again, to each their own. But if we out here talking about we divine feminines and we all have masculine and feminine within ourselves and all this other stuff, and whoa, 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 then is it really awkward to give your person flowers, even if it's not flowers, to give them a gift of appreciation, a token of your love, anything to say, I really love you. I really love you. You know? And so I feel like this person understands that because your actions, you're not coming to them being flashy and this and that saying, hey, this is what I have. And notice here, a whole bunch of flowers. So it's like you you come bearing God's love. That's what flowers represent, God's love. Okay. And in return, this person is giving you God's love. So it's reciprocity at its best, at its finest. All right. Engagement, wedding, rejoice in your union third time's a charm all right now we heard something yesterday or was it earlier today don't recall about charm i think it was earlier today okay <clears throat> so yeah let us whoa wait a minute that's a lot so somebody may have needed to free themselves yeah whoa not another deception card somebody needs to free themselves in order to make the effort oh and not another deception card. Not spirit coming through like this. Where is my strength? Whoa. Yeah, where is it? Somebody needs to like get some backbone or something. We have sore, okay? Bald eagle. Get in the bigger picture. Am I ready to be seen? Am I ready for my truth to be discovered? Am I ready for the world to know who I really am? Because now that I remember who I am, it's time for me to get to it right what eternal knowing can i access in human form knowing who i am knowing that i am god in the flesh knowing that i am safe all right how can i be of service big blue stem go to your auntie house go to your auntie's house please somebody anybody all right swim not the leopard frog am i flowing through metamorphosis go to your not metamorphosis not that when we talk about butterflies and transformation. Not that when it's a star card here. What? What even is that? All right. Because this is a new deck. I'm going to need that. What is that? All right. Heading over to the Patreon. We're going to dig into what this is because, baby, this is giving it go to Gelb. Okay, so we're going to look at what that is over Yandi. All right, on the Patreon. Uh, it go together. Real bad. <laughs> or should I say real good? No ditty. No ditty. <laughs> What riches do I carry within prairie soil? Mm, hold. Somebody feels like you are theirs to have and to hold. You, They are yours to have and to hold. All right. Again, over on the Patreon, we will be digging deeper into these messages. All right. What is ready to go so I can grow? Woo! Wildfire. Burn. Burn, baby. Burn. Hey. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Other line of energy. Oh, my gosh. Yes, real bad. Real bad. All right, so we're going to have to definitely dig into that. Over on the Patreon, Yin Yang Lover is giving Yin Yang energy here. Okay, we're going to see what's going on over on the Patreon dig. Like I said, deeper into that. Let us see what is going on with the Tarot. Get some love messages from your person. <laughs> and we are going to clarify over on the Patreon. Okay. Woo! Love offer coming in. Okay. This is my Ace of Pentacles um, engagement ring. 
queen of wands they find you to be super attractive okay it's my ace of pentacles it's the ace of pentacles my engagement ring nine of wands this person is tired tired of what tired of hiding the fact that you are their heart's desires okay they are just ready to come into union um earlier i kept hearing all of these messages come on in a row the messages are basically saying like this you are theirs uh, you know i am yours you are mine to have and to hold you know to death do us part and beyond to infinity <laughs> beyond type shit um you know homie lovers friends is definitely the vibe you know um being each other's confidants the vibe okay not wanting to lose this energy the vibe your eight of swords so this person is thinking a lot possibly thinking too much all right overthinking stressing themselves out you know outside interference what am i going to do about these these blocks or this could just be the person that was aiming to control mm, there is no block spirits listen spirit is in control at the end of the day so whatever spirit says is going to be is going to be whether we want certain things or not ace of pentacles again my engagement ring so that's twice so that's like the fourth time or the fifth time that engagement or union is being emphasized okay queen of wands how attracted to you they are how drawn to you they are to the point where they think about you all day they think about you all night queen of pentacles it's like they're not going to get rest until they take this mask off and they stop hiding these true feelings you understand what i'm saying to you okay all right we have the seven of pentacles yeah so this could be something that issue they've been waiting or they feel like you've been waiting for so long that you just decided to move forward one or the other they've been sitting here trying to wait for the right time to do something being stubborn but nope as soon as you go ahead and say like i said earlier yeah i'm letting go i release this i'm done here comes the king of cups let me express my love and how stuck on you i am the hangman you know i feel stuck on you and until i say something or do something i don't have peace but i'm over here with this person and i feel stuck in this situation six of cups and you know, again, something about inner child, okay? It could also have something just to do with the second house, the fourth house, you know? Um, and karma connected to those things, okay? That they have to deal with. But we have the seven of wands, determination to stand up and fight for a future with you. Three of wands, okay? Person feels like they're going to slowly but surely come towards you. That's the best way to approach this situation. Yeah, but they still want this brand new beginning. Six of Pentacles, reciprocity. And like I said, Page of Pentacles, good news being received in terms of the physical. Because Three of Swords, heartache and pain is what they have been feeling. And they feel guided by spirit. That could be what that star energy is to make this offer to the feminine. You know, let me go ahead. This is the masculine, right? Sun energy. Let me go ahead and make this offer to the feminine. All right, the moon. All right. That's what I'm feeling heavy okay yeah intuition trust what it is that you know and the knowledge that you have the information that is provided to you based on this person's actions patterns different things like that yeah see they're being guided to take a risk moon flower they're not they're talking about flowers and then the moon feminine i feel like you're this person's flower oh celebration oh you guys the past yeah leave the past in the past oh self-regulation mm. okay picking up on many things the spectrum you and your person could be on the spectrum you or your person or both avoid drama yeah oh this person could just like you know avoid certain feelings and emotions because they feel like it comes with drama but with you it's so different and that's what they're starting to notice it makes them feel so safe guys change your tune yeah it's helping them change their tune when it comes to how they express themselves because with you expressing themselves it flows harmoniously like music all right releasing oh so they're releasing their their negative thoughts surrounding love and what love is like all right and they're you know taking this chance taking this risk utilizing their free will choice to follow spirit yeah the higher power wow underlying energy here watch for signs more butterflies 
You guys. Ugh, you're always trying to make blue cry on the camera. All right, yeah, it's sad. <laughs> so what is sad without you? Oh my goodness. <clears throat> chemistry, yeah, they can't deny the chemistry in children. You make them feel alive again. This person could have been going through a lot. You know, they, they're dealing with some shadow healing right now. Whenever the two of you need each other, you're right there. It's a beautiful energy. Never lose it. Yeah, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. You could have told them that. And, you know, they could have told you that. Like, yeah, this, I'm not losing this. I'm not letting this go. This is a forever thing. No matter what we choose to do with it, you know. That's what it is. Yeah, let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Yeah, I feel like um, they're fighting their feelings. You're fighting your feelings or you're holding back. Because you may sense that this person is looking at you kind of funny or weird. Or they were. They're definitely not anymore, okay? That energy has shifted in a major way. Yeah, they cannot keep wearing this mask. You know, this deception energy, they can't keep doing that. Yeah, new love. They're ready to rekindle. You see, this person is on bended knee. A new person has stared their romantic feelings, okay? But this could also be someone returning, so don't just be like, oh my God, no, someone new. But <laughs> keep an open mind, okay? Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations, which I feel like could be where they are coming from. All right, or even for you, they, they may just be different than what you usually date, what you usually go for, etc., etc. Different things like that. Okay. So we're going to, like I said, do these, and then we're going to. I'm gonna pull a few of these guys, not too many. A few of these here. Um, we're going to do these cards over on the Patreon. Okay, it's a few cards we got to do, so we got to break that dit down. We're going to clarify all of the Tarot cards over on the Patreon as well. And we're going to pour, pull more um, love messages. <laughs> pour more, child. Pull more love messages. Maybe your person is pouring up right now. Maybe that's what's helping them build up the nerve or the courage to come, to you, come towards you. Okay, I also heard... Um, What's that song? It was something else earlier playing, but it was about that, like building up the, the courage, the liquid courage. All right. It says, I have begun my awakening process. This journey is bringing me closer to you. See? Okay. The odds don't always seem to be in my favor. I struggle with negative thinking. Didn't I say that? They're releasing that. All right. Your love is really helping them with releasing that. My karma has been catching up to me. Allow me time and space to sort through it. Okay. Okay. My love for you grows with each passing day. Aww. That'd be what that new love is. Like every day it feels new. Okay. I find you in every lifetime. I won't ever give up on us. Aww. I work my fingers to the bone to provide you with anything you need or want. So, and or want, okay? I want you more than you know. Can I have you? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> your self-love shows me you know your worth. Never settle. And the underlying energy here is far from typical, not at all what you're used to. I'm ready for whatever you're ready for. Solid, okay? So, I really pray that this helps you. I know that it will. If this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and agree.